Hey everybody, what is going on? It is your boy Joker playing some Monocom at 4. I hope that intro wasn't really awkward for you because it was really awkward. I was like, why do I have that sign that says SXC Joker is sexy? That was kind of weird. I don't know what I was thinking back in the day, but hey, I was really young back then. I'm still young, by the way. Anyways, I do enjoy playing Monocom at 4. So the, there's going to be two things that I'm going to be talking about. The first thing is, what's the difference between Monocom at 4 and Monocom at 5? pros and the cons. Uh, the second thing I'm going to be talking about is why do people say, hey, I like Monocom at 4 more than Monocom at 5, and why do people say I like Monocom at 3 more than Monocom at 4, Monocom at 5, Monocom yeah, it's, it's complicated, but I would be talking a little bit about that in the second topic. The first topic here is, um, what's the difference? The difference is, you can actually notice the difference. Modern Combat 5 doesn't have any custom games, but there's, there are rumors that uh, Gameloft is going to do uh, put Modern Combat 5 some custom games in there. And uh, I really do, in, I'm actually looking forward to that. I don't know what they're planning and doing, but I really hope they actually do custom games. That would be really fun to watch and what, you know, see how that goes out. Modern Combat 4 doesn't really have squad battles, which is kind of lame. I kind of wish they did have squad battles. That would be awesome. But uh, basically, Modern Combat 4 has custom games. This is this is the good part. And uh, Modern Combat 5 doesn't have custom games, but Modern Combat 5 has squad battles. So that's the only... That's like kind of trades off, you know? Cause, so they're both kind of even right now. But I'd rather have custom games. That's to be honest with you guys. Anyways, now, uh, Modern Combat 4 hit markers are very, very nice. Like, I, I actually, when I started playing, I realized that the hit markers actually hit their target. In Modern Combat 5, the hit markers are a little bit broken. So if you spam like 100 bullets sometimes to a player while strafing, it does not really do the job like it doesn't really like kind of hit the target and it the hit markers are kind of broken in my opinion monica my five but i know that there's a lot of rumors as well stop pushing me guys why are these guys pushing me i'm gonna fast forward this up anyways monica my five there's a lot of rumors that uh people are saying that the monica my five are gonna fix their hit markers and i really do hope they do because if they don't that's gonna be really really bad i really want the hit markers fixed all right, that's the second part that I wanted to say. I honestly, um, overall, Modern Combat 4 has going nice. And uh, I'm gonna close my window. Anyways, Modern Combat 4 has throwing knives. And Modern Combat 5 doesn't have throwing knives, but grenades and landmines, which is kind of lame. I really do really, 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 really want throwing knives. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Are really fun and uh, but they don't have throwing knives and that's the sad part I really wanted throwing knives all right now modern combat 5 um, look at that bomber look at that bomber six kills with it okay so now modern combat 4 and modern combat 5 the thing that they don't have is a nuke they really really need to add a nuke like a high kill streak they really do seriously need to add a nuke added into the game. I'm pretty sure they're going to put it up to 25 kills because battle mode ends at 30 kills. So yeah, they they probably are going to never do that, but hopefully they do and it'll be really cool. Now the second topic that I wanted to talk about was why do people say they like Modern Combat 4 and Modern Modern Combat 5 and why do people say the opposite? But uh, the reason why is probably where they started. They first started is probably in Modern Combat 4 or they started first in Modern Combat 5 or they started back in Modern Combat 3 you know um, it doesn't really matter where they started it's just the way they see themselves play really good in so I I think I see myself I play really well in all of the Modern Combats but I honestly whenever I see players say that I know like the players that I really know really well and I'm really good friends with and I know why they say they like this game more than the other game because they're really good at it of course and they spend a lot of time there and I understand you know I, I understand where they're coming from but um, to be honest I do love Modern Combat 3 it's my favorite game I love Modern Combat 3 more than Modern Combat 4 and Modern Combat 5 combined I really did enjoy it because I first started back in Modern Combat 1 and I continued in Modern Combat 2 Modern Combat 2 wasn't my jam. Um, then Modern Combat 3 came out, 
I fell in love with the game. It was like the most like fast paced game I have ever played. It was super easy. The reloading, the guns were amazing. The quality was kind of a little bit lame now because right now only the highest quality you can get from that game was like 720. But um, back in the day, you can play on that Monocoma 3 with an iPad 1 or an iPod 4th generation. It, would, it wouldn't lag that much. And it was, that's the game that I really like. I really, really, really love Modern Combat 3. It was, it was my jam, you know? Like I said, it was a really good game for me. It was, you know, very enjoyable. And uh, it's, it's now a lot of people are confused. They're like, yeah, I get you, Joker, but what do you mean? Well, here's the thing. People like Modern Combat 4, and then when Modern Combat 5 came out, everyone were, was a lot, a lot of MC4 players were really pissed off. Um, because it looked kind of cartoony and all that stuff and that's what a lot of people were saying a lot of people were really mad they didn't really want to play it they didn't like it and uh, that's the same thing that happened to me when Monarch Man 3 was you know playing and then Monarch Man 4 was coming out nobody like especially with me I was really really upset about it and now that I kind of understood I saw people doing the same thing in Monarch Man 4 to Monarch Man 5 they were like Oh my god, are you serious? And that's what happens when a new game kind of comes out. You expect something else, and you expect the same thing, but it doesn't, and it gets a little bit worse. <laughs> I'm just kidding, but it does kind of, they try to improve and stuff, but you're like, man, it's getting worse and worse. But, that, hey, that's my opinion, and uh, I hope you guys didn't get any, like, think, I guess I offended you. I really hope I didn't offend you. See you guys in the next one. Peace out.